What's up ladies and gents and welcome back to Age of Empires Definitive Edition. We are back with the Rise of Rome campaign. This time the last mission, Mithridates. Let's listen to it. Mithridates, the cunning king of Pontus, has expanded his kingdom on the Black Sea coast at the expense of Rome's allies in Anatolia. Claiming descent from both Alexander and the Persian king Cyrus the Great, he has incited the Greeks and Easterners to rebel against our interests. He has even forged an alliance with the mighty Tigranes, king of Artaxiad, Armenia. The Senate is dispatching you with the legions to restore our eastern domains and humble this so-called king of kings. I find it interesting, like, they're so above their head that they're calling themselves a king of kings and not just, you know, a king. As if that isn't good enough. Destroy the wonder of Pontus. Okay, hence. Weaken the defense of the enemy by sea to establish a safe landing ground. Concentrate solely on the mission. Complete conquest is unlikely. It isn't. Like, it really isn't. <laughs> Alright, let's jump into it. So, how do we start this? We'll take these guys, the we'll scout, this, the other scout. You guys go on to here. Say, can you please... Useless. What are you? Okay. So this is full. Romans defeated. Great. That's exactly what you need. Why were Romans Minoan? Let's get up here. Let's land there. You get number two. You get number one. So, now. Obviously you could see land here, but that's not where we want to go. We want to go up here to start the mission. Trust me, you do. You do not want to go down there to start the mission. Oh, I mean, I guess you technically could, but I don't think that's a good idea. So. Where is that? Now you probably also don't want to build free, thank you very much. You probably also don't want to build your base at the coast. Let's grab these units. Oh, there's more. Whoops. Okay. Didn't see them. Embarrassing. A bit. Right, let's scout out a little bit because I want to get a good spot for my base. You can see stone down here. Red is somewhere in this vicinity. Again, I've just quickly made sure that I get the start right. I didn't put too much time into... Oops. I didn't put too much time into figuring out everything about this mission just yet. Because, as you might know, I do want to know what I'm talking about with these missions, but I also want to play them in a way that I kind of get to know the exact mission together with you, if that makes any sense. So we need houses. Actually, where we build houses is in strategic locations. Because I don't want to be surprised. And kind of what, what I want to do is funnel the opponents towards me. If that makes sense, which I think it does. And there are two ways to play this. Now, first you can focus on land, which is the way I would play this, or you can start focusing on 
Tell them off. Tell me. The water relatively early. Obviously you have these couple of ships there which are helpful but we're not going to do too much for you. There you go, another house. And kind of what we want to do is funnel the opponents into our area here where we can defeat them. Uh, didn't work. It's not very well. Going well. Okay. As you can see, we have ballistas here, and I must say, I actually like ballistas a lot. They're among my favorite units to build. Goodbye. Retreat, retreat, retreat. We don't want to go up there yet. Which might be a bit of a conservative approach, I must admit, but... It's just right now, it's not what I want to do, because they do have towers as defense. Where am I? Ballistas are very good units in this game, by the way, and they are criminally underrated, in my opinion. Probably the most underrated unit ever <laughs> in this game. Uh oh oh. I mean that. I really think they are one of the most underrated units in this game. Damn it. Oh, that worked well. And I do seriously think ballistas are great units. I really do. You might not think that, but I do. Did we have a priest? Apparently we did. Okay. Good to know. So we're just trying to get this started here. How did red come down here? Alright, so, the houses we need, which really isn't very many, and now we're just waiting, get our economy up a little bit. We could try to rush them, as they're really not particularly great, but... Actually, I will do that. Why will I do that? Because we don't really need these units. Okay, we'll charge through. We should reach our base relatively soon. There we are. Now we'll just try to take down our base. Number one. Okay. As you can see, we can just run past these without taking too much damage, which is good. Alright, let's get some more villagers out. There we go, there's the barracks, and there's the archery range. Technically, if you're very pedantic, you could say, well, I should take it down the archery range first, but I don't really care right now. We'll take them down regardless. This is down. Take down the market. Okay. Alright, so this is going a lot better. The thing we should be afraid of is landings, mostly from yellow, 
as a red base up here retarded. It doesn't really scare us. And we will prepare for that soon enough. But there's always a but, right? Um, not right now. Right now, I want to get this. Show you soon why. Because for a change, we're actually going to wall up. I know I don't wall up, but for a change, we do. And now it's shocking. Uh, this is expensive. Maybe we're just walling up with regular walls. So we will do this, but... Yes, there is, as always, a but. Um, yeah, let's do it like this. Do this, do this. And now we're just waiting. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Building a couple more villagers. And we will send these guys on to the stone. And a couple more on to the gold. Let me show you how you actually go for this. Now we're just destroying their economy and the last remains of him on this island should be gone. You want to go scout a little more. You might be wondering what the hell am I doing here. I'm building a defense. As weird as that might sound. Eh, we should do that. Whoops. That worked well. So, these guys. Anything still left up here? Probably not. So what we will do now is build a siege workshop. Can I delete this? No, not all of them. This one. Like this. You will understand what I'm doing here soon enough. I hope. I hope I will understand this soon enough. What do we have here? Temple. Time to take that down and we want this. That's a bit too expensive, okay. So, should they land here? We want to be able to funnel them into a choke point, which is what we are doing right there. And we want to rain arrows on them when we do. Right. So far, so good. You, on the other hand, will build a wall here. You will scout a bit to the north. Should give you a number two. You guys are probably done destroying them. Should get over here. We will build a catapult. We'll take them down. And are probably good to go. Okay, you're okay. So, next step. Phalanx. Nope, not yet. Alright, next step. Dark. One. Two. Why two? Well, in case of emergency, I want to be able to produce ships a little bit quicker. We have 
blisters here. As you can see, like the enemy units will go this way, which is where we funnel them, and then we can just meet them here. I mean, we see them land soon enough, so we can just react and send units. Can actually send all our units down there. Okay. Apparently we just destroyed something, and apparently they are still active here, which I don't like. Dead. Dead. I have quite a lot of attack. Fifteen. It's two strikes. Pretty good. Where is a catapult? So, other buildings we need. A government center. Get up triremes. Once our triremes are done, we should be able to make a charge at yellow a little bit. What do we have up here? We always have these stone mines everywhere on this island. There's gold, that's good to know. As always, gold a very important resource. Okay, there's nothing up here. That's good to know. I want this, I want this, and I want this. For a change, I do want everything, yes. We are taking down this tower here. Very good. And I think we are done destroying everything up here. Yes, we are. So let's come down here, see if there's anything here or here, and if not, we are done with them. Alrighty. Let's set up our economy up here. Okay, nothing here. I'm not wondering why am I moving my economy. Well, should they land here and pass through here and start raiding here? Well, guess what? My economy is now up here. At least a part of it. I'm not planning to move my entire economy there. That's just necessary. So, let's strengthen our units a little bit. Already up to their occupation. And we will do the automatic reseeding here. Getting phalanx. Which is a very important upgrade. Let's get a fifth trireme. And nope. Not enough food. These two guys join up. And we want. Temple. Should get rid of one house, which is okay. We can still produce to a pop limit. It's fine. And I will scout out a little bit more. <coughs> we can find anything over here. There's another coast. So it gives us a good idea of how wide this island is that we are on, or this mainland. However you want to describe it. This is stretching pretty far. Interesting. Where does this lead? Okay, so these guys will get onto a gold. No, 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 no. You know what? Might go up there. Now we're at the pop limit. Sorry, mate. I may or may not have killed our scout. Totally by accident. <coughs> so, I have a ballista and four heavy cavalry here. Which is good. Oops. You can be number two. So we will soon heal up there. We are gathering resources up there, which that's good. Don't want to take down that base or do I wanna go this way? 
Who attacked this? Wonder is here, by the way, so... Where is that? Oh, it's expensive. 1800. Okay. We'll get there eventually, right? Can you please heal? Useless. Increases priest healing rate. Probably not worth it, right? It's required for legions. What do you... heal? Useless. Actually, you get number two. You guys... three. Um, do we have a market? I don't think we do. Which is a pretty big blunder if you think about it. Heal! What's up with this guy? I kinda want to destroy this. Ugh, useless. Heal quicker, please. Actually, mark it, and this is for heavy catapult. Good. I like heavy catapults too much to ignore them. You know, it drops us back a little bit in terms of the good old food, which we need for centurions. But right now, we're not producing centurions anyway, so don't really care. What we could be doing is upgrade these guys, since we do have a considerable amount of them. So I actually will do that. Again, we do have a considerable amount of them. We also have given them plenty upgrades through... Oops. Through also upgrading the... What's the other unit called? Centurions. Or is that their base stats that we get? I mean, the long swords, man. We don't actually have that research, that costs 1800. It's also expensive, but I don't really care about food. That's the thing. I don't care about food, and I don't care about the wood. Because there's plenty of wood here, and with plenty of wood, you get plenty of food, so I don't really care about that. Let's attack. It would take forever to wait for all these upgrades to finish. <laughs> The only thing that bugs me a little bit is this longsword thing. Getting up to Centurion. Ugh. Of course. Straight for the catapult. Like, these gold casts are a little bit worrying, but the rest is fine. It's really just the gold that worries me. Let's grab some stone. Because maybe what we could do is a tower push. Once we are on their land. Now, now the Romans don't have great towers. We could land there and push our way here. I'm not quite sure what we are going to do and, or how we are going to approach it. It could be an idea though. Let's upgrade to legions. We have enough gold right now to justify doing this. Let's quickly grab all the stone here and then we get onto this gold. Moving attacked. Here. Okay. 
I don't care about that. You get number three. You get number four. Okay. So he is here to heal the catapult. That's his sole purpose. Wonder if they actually upgrade to Legion. If the upgrade applies to them, would be good to know. We are get down to one thousand. There's more gold, that's good. Okay, that's interesting that we are seated right here. We have 9 right, we have 14, so that's good. We severely outrange these towers. Very comforting. Yep, we're legions now. Very good. They do have pretty good stats if you think about it. I sometimes underestimate how good legions are just because of how much they suck against. Okay, where was the landing? Just because of how much they suck against Centurions in a direct combat. But obviously Centurions are the unit to have in terms of direct melee combat. So. Well, maybe just regarding Elephants here a little bit, but Elephants are another topic on their own. And not available to a lot of civs, so where's that? But the other thing why I disregard legions a lot is because of how strong the centurion is. But if you look at the legion stats, you have 160 HP, you have fairly decent armor. You actually have pretty good attack stat. They are fairly mobile, especially for an infantry unit, so that's pretty good. And overall, they're a very solid all-round unit. That's just really the, the whole... Well, but you could be building Centurions instead type deal. But if you think about it, you could only build half the Centurions because of uh, the upgrade that you get. What's it called? Nope. What's it called? This one. Yes. Logistics. Where your barracks, barracks units only take half a population slot. That is obviously making legions a very good choice because you can just build so many of them in comparison to what you can build when you go for centurions. That being said, you still don't want to build any against actual centurions because... Well, an army of 10 centurions still beats 20 legions, in my experience, so... You don't want to counter them with it, even though you can build twice as many of them, but... I don't think any sane person builds legions to counter centurions. Or really, any melee unit. Apart from, like I said, maybe elephants, but even then I don't think it's cost-effective to do that. Priests, ballistas, pretty good at countering them. The thing is, as strong as centurions are, they are pretty easy to counter if you use these units. Where we have Helipolis. Which is a great unit. Again, like the Ballista, criminally underrated.
quite sure what exactly it is on this island that they just don't defend it very much. Alright, we now have a heavy catapult. We'll take down this. Uh oh. Build a wall. Yeah, he's half dead, but I don't really care. I'm not sure we did what we wanted to do. I could have prevented this attack and maybe killed him. Either way, it's now a Roman unit, so I don't care. I can actually go scout, we don't need you. It's also one of those units that is actually pretty good, but I don't, just don't build it. A heavy cavalry unit. That's... If you think about it, it lags with base stats of some of the other units. Obviously it makes a lot of that up with speed, especially compared to these infantry units like the legions. It makes a lot of that up with speed, but... No, I was never the one to build quick units instead of strong units. Obviously they have their application. Oops. In their main benefit obviously is raiding. Which in a game against humans, that's great. But I don't know why, but I was never that big into raiding the AI. Just always seemed a little unnecessary. You can just brute force your way for most AI, so where's that? Now we can listen when the space is done. Oh, we died. Okay. Interesting. Now he's dead. I think this is going to die now. Yep. Alright, so let's go scout a little bit. We are now going to shift plants. But burn wool. Why are you shifting plants? What are you going to do next? Next we are going to focus on the water and we are going to make some population room. Namely by getting rid of these three guys. We are first going to use triremes to clear the coast a little bit. And then we're going to look at how we proceed. I'm not quite sure yet. I think I have a pretty good idea of how I want to do this. Generally I want to move up here first. And then I want to kill this and then I want to make the landing either over here. Because this would bring us pretty close to here. And what I don't want to do... Get up here. Uh, yeah, that worked well. Can we attack? Uh oh, it's not good. That's no good. Out of the way. <laughs> what the hell was this? Okay, we are driving. That's a close spot. And we lost kind of all of our ships. Okay. 
We literally lost all of our ships. Two more are going down. Okay, okay. I didn't see this coming. To be quite honest with you. I very much did not. Okay, um... We should still have a strong enough army. Come on, my plan is build transports here, transport over here, bum rush with wonder. Win mission. That's my plan. Legions are so inexpensive if you think about it compared to building up an army of Centurion. It's much easier to build a Legion army. Grab the gold up here. And destroy this. You get onto gold. We are already playing fast speed, now it gets faster, right? Right now we're playing on very fast because this is taking too long. Alright, two juggernauts. Make short work of them. Okay, the juggernauts will be number three, I think. Move a little bit closer. I find it funny how it has more range than vision. Well, in a way I find it funny, in a way I also find it silly. But we're... there we go. We could also land here. Not sure. It's one of these let's see how we proceed things. Or you're not quite sure beforehand. Oh, we almost got through here already. <laughs> we have more gold, but there is more gold, okay. I'm not sure these guys can make it. I'm actually going to delete you. And yes, I am aware we have gold down here. Right. Oh, this should soon be grabbed. Another tower down. We really don't have much in terms of defense up there. Well, it's interesting. So these guys, while defending here, they are not that useful. What the hell? Why are you not? Actually, I want to give him number three. You are number two. Three and four. Thank you very much. Good. So, let's make a little more progress here. Nope, no more progress to be made. This is down, very good. Hey, another transport. Rip. This, okay, so they are here. You, my friend, go over here. That's not going to work. What's this? It's also probably not going to work. Okay. 
Okay, there we go. We're just destroying the coastline a little bit when we clear this passage and move our way up here. What the hell? Stop fishing here. I don't actually fear that they would be of some kind of danger, but you never know, right? So I'm just besieging them a little bit, making sure that they kind of learn their lesson, kind of type deal. There we go. Okay, so let's swim here, you do this, you get here, you, my friend, build a duck. You're dead. Sorry. Odd one out. Type deal. Gather here. Heavy transport. Just do this, I don't care. Actually, we don't need to do this, we just do this. Build two transports. And research heavy transport here. Wait, juggernauts? Yes, we are. As you might know. Or maybe not, I don't know. Hey, they're one point ahead of us, that's funny. These guys will probably die. Living in an illusion or anything, they can very well die here. I am fully aware of that. And as unfortunate as that would be, we will just replenish units and send more. That's no good. And now we've overtaken them and score as well. Obviously that doesn't mean too much considering that there are a lot more guys. Maybe we found brown. Interesting. I remember when I first played this, which is a long time ago, but I never knew where brown was because I always was like, let's land here or down here and move along the coast. I never really cared, to be honest, because they were so inconsequential to the mission, in my mind. But I just... I didn't care. They didn't play much of a role. I mean, you can tell right now they still don't. They just don't play much of a role in this mission. And I just happened to notice that it was a brown villager, but could have just as well overlooked that. Okay. It is actually quite risky to land these guys, or to, to put them onto the ships already, because we haven't yet cleared their landing spot. So, yes, it is rather risky what we're doing here. Goodbye. Damn it. So, I don't want to land here because the walls are already breached. That's the sole reason behind it. Uh -oh. Is that a brown duck? I thought it was a yellow duck. Maybe I was just not being able to tell the difference between brown and yellow. I don't know. Maybe I actually killed brown and didn't know this. <laughs> it's very much possible. this down. Let's get onto the coast. As you can see we're kinda dead. I don't think we're going to put up much of a fight or resistance. We however might now we try to rebuild the axe but we just can't. We try and try and try but they really they just can't. We not outrage from 7 plus 2, 7 plus 3, we do, but we once again just can't. <laughs> it's 
kind of funny. But as you can see, I mean, the mission says complete conquest is unlikely, and I'm not interested in complete conquest right now because it would just take forever, and we're already making this take a little bit longer than I want. That's interesting. Okay, so they use inferior ships to kill us. That's fantastic. Didn't think this would be a thing. Let's actually kill these guys. Let's kill you as well. I don't care. I don't care about this island anymore, to be honest. We are what the hell are you doing? I'm creating base here, left and right. Wait, how many can we put on there? Seven. Alright, let's get out an army here. Oops. There we go. I will take this down. I'm not accepting defeat here. Certainly not accepting defeat. Oh, no. Number three. Oh. Ballista tower, ballista tower. They will have a lot of towers where I fear. Juggernaut? Free juggernauts? Okay. Fine. Um, you know your number. Okay, you are number one, and you are number two. I like to give low numbers to the units that I require urgently at that moment. Okay, we we'll wait for this. I don't even care about the last one. We should be able to wipe them out right now. <coughs> I guess one front. They're dead. I just didn't expect this. I mean, had I known that, I would have attacked with a bigger army, but... Didn't see that coming. But, you know, you can adjust, you can rebuild, and... Kill them a little bit later, I don't really care. What are you doing? So, let's actually bring our transports into the field. Oh, it might have been a little close, no it wasn't. Did he just run away again after trying to build? That's funny. I think this is an entry to the wonder where this tower is. There's another tower. I think we land here and go straight forward. We're just clearing away here. As you can see, we have a lot of towers in the general area. Shouldn't be able to hold anything on us. Well. There's another one. Closer. We are right there. What I actually thought about doing, which probably also works, is like load up 20 heavy catapults and bum rush with them. While landing here, which probably also works. Build another one. It's funny. Um, you know what? Okay. 
You know I've got number one. Actually, we can just let the catapult take care of it, I don't care. No, no. I hate that some of these legions count as we own ones and then the other ones as the given ones and you can't double click and select all of them for some reason. I never understood what the point of that was, just let me click my units. Like, I can group them as a number and that's fine as well. But. Victory! Campaign done, finally. Oh, that was a long mission. Your victory over Mithridates and his allies has recovered our eastern provinces and restored peace. We now control most of the Mediterranean coastline, although the sea itself is still rife with pirates who resist Roman rule. With Greece and the east pacified, Rome can now turn to clearing the sea of these pirates and make the Mediterranean a truly Roman lake. Mediterranean Sea, a lake. Okay, <laughs> that's fine. Um, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. We probably made this a little longer than it had to be, but, you know, better play it safe. And, yeah, I hope you can do this as well and finish this campaign. So, until next time, farewell.